Camp Slayer three weeks okay. previously. Jesus, Eric, give me time. This is me. This is my way of dealing with it, and I'm done trying to explain it to you. Yes, yes, this is my life now, and I'll live it on my terms. I don't know why we're why jumping times. Oh, uh, bad time? Yeah, it's a real fucking bad time. I'm just dropping off the files you requested. Not now. I said not now. Well, I, I didn't mean to upset you. It's not you. Uh, seems like out here we're, we're all running away from something. I know I am. You were caught up in that mess at the checkpoint. You shot that woman. It's okay. You can talk to me. It's just... Everyone seems to have an opinion on it. I'm dealing with it... in my own way. Are you? You got your own problems. And whoever that was, that sounded like a, a gold medal asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever it is, you'll deal with it. How does this affect? The word. And I'll handle it for you. How does this influence what is going on down in the depths of hell? There we go. Jason. Jason, you're here. Looks like he had a big ass gash on his arm. It always looks like their eyes are not actually Let's looking where they should be looking. Like, her eyes are looking downward. She's not even looking forward. Like, where her gun's pointed right now. Nick, I thought I lost you. I thought I'd lost you. Ah, oh, God. Oh, hey, it's a half vampire man. Ah, I told you, the gun wouldn't have done shit. Oh, my God, he's so fast. I guess this is where Nick could die. Over there. Uh, shut it. guy's pretty fast for being over a thousand years old. Ah, fuck these things. Oh my god, how long is this gonna go on for? Here we go. Oh my god. I feel like they abuse these. Oh. And this is how he dies. 
I fucked up. hundred percent sure that's how he was going to die kind of worked out maybe he could have died if I would have chosen the rifle over the crucifix way before but of course he's alive he's a vampire not like they're carrying garlic in their backpacks that was too close back there. We're still breathing. We've not all been so lucky. All that matters is you're okay. Don't touch me. Do we need to talk? About what? About us. I need to know what's happening with us. If I die tonight, I, I want to die think... knowing where I stand with you. I don't think that's... This is not the time, friend. Seeing Eric again? He reminded me of the man that I fell for all those years ago. See, it's like their eyes don't follow where they should. The most. I'll forever be thankful for that. Something's changed? I don't need anyone's help to climb out of my own hell. It's over, Nick. Let's go find Kolchak. I understand. That's what you want. Didn't she have a gold ring on earlier? It's funny. Instead of a silver one? For today, I had planned on leaving Eric for good. But he held tight to that rope. All the way. That's gotta mean something. I had so much I wanted to say to him. But I ran out of road. It's Jason. He's alive. So holding up the rope definitely had a a big impact without cutting it. Um, even though that's what got Eric killed. Now we're with Jason and the unknown structure descend to hell. Fucked up shit in my life. Nothing comes close to this. Yeah. They don't seem to be following. Do you like to wait for them or? I'll need to be a smart ass. Let's move. You think this is a safe way back? Uh, right now it's the only that? way back, so... Ledger 3. Many finds in the temple confirm our hypothesis that the temple was used for sacrifice. We know that a century-long drought afflicted the Akkadian Empire, the same dry spell that afflicted the old kingdom in Europe. In Egypt, the drought caused by the abandonment of cities across Mesopotamia grew the barbarian tribes down from the mountains to the plains, bringing them into conflict with the Akkadians. In this temple, we see evidence of increasing desperate attempt to turn the tide by appeal to the gods related finds, black onyx. Onyx stones were symbolic of negative energy and the calamity, possibly to believe that evil uh you dug demons inhabited the earth, hold stones. Stone shows figures praying towards the eclipse combined with our six beast portrays an eclipse that beast stages a danger or a disaster. Remember, 
When did you become a scientist? They don't teach you American science at school. We should stay clear of it. I was gonna say, remember the saliva has uh, like psychedelic shit in it. Belongs to Randolph Hodgson. Maybe he's got some intel that could help. That didn't help him. Ah, shit. All the pages are torn out, so that's good. That's a good sign. something else over here. Oh, this might be the pages of his... Oh, no, it's not. It's a locket. Mary Hodgson. She got to be his wife. Their story didn't end so well. Jason. What? I can't end up like this. When this temple falls, my wife and I will be dead. I owe her that, at least the portrait that I carry in my case. For the Mary that I remember, not that thing. This was all Lady Bradshaw's doing. Damn it, Lady she Bradshaw. She knew all along what was down here. She led us to them. I found her below, hunched over the murdered corpse of Van Hoyten. As she turned to face me, I saw that she had changed. My hand fell to the closest weapon I could find, an iron tent peg. I stabbed her with the metal, impaling her in the heart. She died. Unholy screams echoed from deep below, as if answering the sudden release of blood. That's fun. Oh cool, it's the altar of the Vampire King. It's Dracula. Like some ancient alien shit. In Wakanda. Yeah, what you said. What the fuck is this place? So we go from vampires to aliens real quick. judged God is punishing us all for the mistakes we've ever made that then seems all fair. I have left in this world after my wife left us I gave him my all I wanted him to have everything I could single parent it's a fucking gig it is but my boy has made me very proud. He's going to London, to university. If only he would stop stealing. <laughs> I miss him so much. It 
Because your conscience is clear, Jason. Green zone. Checkpoint. What checkpoint? Nick and I, we were caught in traffic. Checkpoint had been hit before by suicide bombers. There was a woman. She was carrying a bag. Fuck. Tell me. I ordered... I ordered for her to stop. Loud and clear. But she didn't. She just kept on walking. I, uh, I had to make a call. Nick, he shot her dead. What was in the bag? Nothing. Groceries. I don't understand. Why didn't she stop? She didn't hear me. She had fucking headphones on. Huh. This. This is bullshit. I'm not here to honor the dead. Truth is, my life was going nowhere fast. I jumped at the chance to sign up. We all have our reasons. They don't have to be profound. Profound, huh? No towers were hit. Now it's stoned out of my fucking skull. I didn't even hear about it till a week later. How's that for profound? I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing here. You're serving your country. That woman had a family, friends. She had her whole life in front of her. And we snuffed it out with a single bullet. I mean, what the fuck? I can hear you thinking. We're waiting for something to happen. Maybe we should take the initiative and make something happen. What do you have in mind? We go inside there, and we find a way to hurt them. Those fucking things tried to fuck with our heads. They tried to kill us. But you and I, we're both standing. Start believing, Salim. We're gonna get out of here and see the sun again. Is that what you truly believe? Hoorah! What on earth is that sound? It's a marine thing. Oh. So, does that make me a Marine, too? Let's not get ahead of ourselves, huh? Okay. Hey, whatever happens out there, I've got your back. We'll stand together. It's the only way. All right, let's go. Let's go into the alien base now that's full of vampires. Water physics are terrible. And the graphics are all the way up. We're actually hitting right about the four hour mark. I feel like we're getting close to the climax here. But like there's still Nick and Rachel's story. And then these two guys are gonna find something out here.
explosion. This is all because the one guy wanted to sacrifice a bunch of people. This got to be where those things come from. I think so. The question is, where the hell are they? these creatures no it's possible we've got this wrong way around what's that supposed to mean maybe we're intruding on them Lane, check this out <laughs> sounds like music that don't sound like any music from where i'm from Maybe not music, could be uh, a language. You've seen those motherfuckers, they're not exactly the jazz type. We shouldn't underestimate them. At this place, those things are intelligent. This moths is everywhere. Is it just me or is it alive? I can't go over to the left anymore. Looks like gas. Stay close. I ain't going nowhere. Goddamn biblical. Shit! Did you see that? I think it's still alive. Oh, that's impossible. At this place, everything's possible. Holy shit! The fucker's been alive all this time. He's sitting here with half a head. Fluid. Must have preserved his flesh, his brain. What should we do? We can't leave him like this. Well, shit. He's had enough time to get used to it. Are you serious? If we kill him, it. The noise would attract the vampires. If we kill him, it, it might do wake it. him up too. Hmm. I didn't have a choice. That was the guy from the very beginning, I believe.
Yeah, I'm gonna not try and step on the vines, because, like, definitely some shit's gonna happen when you do. I don't understand what all these, like, chair-looking things are. <clears throat> Like, they look like they're sitting in there, like, ready to pilot some shit. Oh, there's a shit ton of cocoons here. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Sleep. What is it? I think we hit the mother load. Oh my god. Yeah, definitely don't step on any of that shit. Fucker. Oh, I woke him up. I did not even see that one on the ground. Oh my, what is this? Shit, Nikki, you turned up like the fucking cavalry. I thought you were dead. Where's Not Rachel? <laughs> Good to see you again, ma'am. Take my hand. you here, man. This place. The Star Chamber.
What is this place? We need a plan. Fuck those things up and get the fuck out. Good plan. Sergeant K, what do we got left? So we got, um... Eight clips of 556 FMJ, three 40 mil high X rounds, a couple of nine mil pistols, four clips between them. We'll make that work. And one block of composition C4. All in is not enough. We've also got this. Ah, it's old, unpredictable. We work with what we got. Our fuses are shot, but we can use the C4 to detonate them. Let's just hope they still back a punch. The vampires come from those cocoons. You saw how many there were in that vault? There could be thousands in there. Should we blow them up? Burn as many of those motherfuckers as we can and head for the surface. What do you think, Sergeant? Ooh, bro. I'm not gonna allow him to carry a pistol. We are way past that point now, man. We stand together as one. Looks like our explorer friends are here too. We should search this place before we move out. Any juicy gossip? belong to Mary Hodgson. Of all the topics she wrote about, one thing stood out more than the rest. What's that? She wanted to go home. Mary's not the only one, is she? Take a look at this cheat music. Good thing to have down in an alien temple of nonsense. As I discover more about the musical language of these creatures, my mind spins and wonder how they came to be here. Did they soar through the skies in the days of the dinosaurs? Great. Empires spanned the globe while they were still swinging from the trees. They are dead now. Their forms are somewhat like our own, but everything else about them is a poet. The console displays what appears to be a constellation of stars, Cetus, as seen from Earth. They come here from beyond, crossing great gulfs of space. Don't they trying to get home? Oh, look, another premonition thing. Cool. Over here. Oh, that's probably um. For the devil in me. Kind of like how there was one at the very end of Little Hope. Hunts victims, implants parasite, parasite gestates, host desk, parasite takes over. Okay. They are coming. We must end it here with blank. If there is time, my last act will be to dictate this diary onto blank. Found in the rubble, it will serve as a any of those who... The bones of this temple are drenched in blood. We have set foot on an uncharted shore and roused something ancient and wicked. A blasphemy that comes in indescribable shapes and forms. For eons, we lived as children in this world. Unaware of the horrors that slumber. Have we seen this already? Now we have blindly thrown open the gates to madness. I fear being taken, but I must do what I must. We must seal this place for eternity, for all mankind. Mary, I'm sorry. Oh, this is the thing we heard on the tape. That's right, at the very beginning, up in the main chambers. Okay. 
None kind of a weird down. ending there. But I wouldn't give to see daylight again. <laughs> daylight and a cold one. Rachel. Yeah. I'm sorry for your loss. Eric was a good man. He was. I'm pretty sure the ring was gold earlier. Okay, let's talk to Nick and then we'll talk to Salim again. How confident are you that they'll work? They'll work. And how are you holding up? Well, not great, truth be told. I should have said it sooner, but I'm, I'm sorry about Eric's death. Thank you. It means a lot. Rachel, I, j I just want to... I want to say that I've come too far to lose you now. We're going to get out of here. I know it. I like your confidence, Bree. All right, Salim. Take us home. describing it. There's meaning here. It's a language formed from chords, musical scales, sonics. Mary was a pianist. She deciphered it. She thought these carvings represented the stars. Do you see? It's Cetus, the whale. We're a long way from the night sky. That's a mystery. According to the journal, there was only one scale of sound in the device. But Mary was studying it alone. I think there may be another. I'm going to need your help. What can I do? This console is too big to operate single-handedly. I don't know what the fuck I was doing there. I was literally just going around in a circle. Which is kind of dumb, but... Isn't that something? Mary believed that these creatures were once peaceful. Their language was one of music. Feel emotion. Then a tragedy fell upon them. Their great empire collapsed. Their music fell silent, and they turned on each other. What happened? A sickness? A madness? What turned them from architects into killers? Whatever it is, it twisted them. Now they're creatures of hate, animals, dead things. No one left to kill. So they slept. And they waited. They waited for us. Is anyone buying this shit? I don't know, but old Mother Mary was right about one thing. There's no more good in this place. Come on, let's go burn these motherfuckers. I do not see how a couple of explosives and some C4 are going to explode all of that. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? 
those mounds are made of cocoons. Thousands of them. If we set the charges there, they won't burn. Gotta move. Quick. Okay, listen up. We've been hit hard tonight. We lost brothers. Including our own colonel. But now, it's time to get some payback. We plan charges on as many of those clusters as possible and then detonate them remotely. The second those charges go off, we haul ass to the exit. Luck is on our side. Do more than fry a few vampires. Create a diversion. If we die here, at least we'll take some of those bastards down with us. Okay. Who's going to place the dynamite? All right, fuck it. I'll do it. You're crazy. We'll do it together. Nah, the more of us down there, the more chances we'll get seen. Take the detonator. If I don't make it, Nick, hear me out. If I don't make it, I want you to blow those charges. Just don't go getting trigger happy on me. Every step of the way, you keep in radio contact. And if there's no radio signal, then I'll pop a flare. You see it go up, you hit that detonator. Be quick and be safe. You hear me, buddy? Okay. This took a hell of a weird turn, but... Shit, where did he go? There. There's one ahead of him. To his left. Nick, the cocoons are hatching ahead of you. You gotta move fast. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. First dynamite is down. It's old vampire man. He's back. I wholeheartedly do not expect Nick to make it out of this. Oh my god. Not again. Maybe Vampire Junior will uh, take out Vampire Senior there. I hate this. Th they abuse this way too much. There's Vampire Jr. over there.
Holy shit. It's getting kind of hairy down there, brother. Why don't you ditch the rest of those charges and head back? Look at that, man. It's the mud boat. It's too far. I can do it. I'm going for it. Oh no. Oh no. What is it? There are too many. He's a dead man. Sweet baby Jesus. Wait! What will warning him do now? There is no way out. How's it looking up there? Kill him. They're all over you, man. Hundreds of them. At least you've got the boss to tell the truth. I'm sorry, Nikki. For this? Or what happened at that checkpoint? It's a war, Jason. Oh my god, okay. so hard with the lighting. Damn it. And he's dead. Had it right until the very last heartbeat. You're wrong. 
Salim is one of us now. Marines don't leave their own behind. You hear him, Miss Salim? If I don't make that, tell my son that I did everything. That voice line doesn't work. Coming to get you. And Rachel's just hanging out over there. Nasty. Oh, seriously, just throw that thing at me. I did. Let's get out of here. I just got an achievement for Salim killing five vampires with his spear, which is pretty cool. back and they both made it to the elevator another uh, achievement <laughs> fucking knew you'd make it my son is waiting for me no evil is going to stop me from seeing him again listen up I'm not out of the woods yet what I see in front of me you're the best fuck that best of the best we will get home. And Nick is, uh, dead. <laughs> I love how Rachel, like, doesn't have any voice lines now. Like, she just fell off the face of the earth in voice lines. Oh, the curator was standing back there. Did you see that? Come on, Lieutenant. I 100% saw the curator standing back there. Oh my god. It's Clarice. I got that or not. Damn it. Shit, I never should have let her go. Girl just didn't know how to stay dead. It feels like that part right there wasn't super fluid. Like it 
Right, like it could have happened or it could have not happened, and it's kind of like they took it and like chunked it in almost. It wasn't, it wasn't a smooth transition. <laughs> so bright. How the hell do we make it through that? Everyone okay? <sighs> We're alive. We're fucking alive. All I care this about is uh, Jason too. and then Celine. Are you receiving? This is Rhino One Five. Solid copy. We're five minutes from your position. Dude, we called them so long ago. Improvise, adapt, and overcome. We fucking did it! I actually forgot how bright it is out here. Yeah. My home's not far from here. All this time, this was under our feet. I need a shower, clean clothes, a comfy bed, and a cold beer. No, not again. About two and a half minutes, depending. Let's go 
it, but just stay knowing you. Oh boy. Giant metal stick, Salim. Oh my god. Aren't you a sight for sore eyes? So got my big metal stick. Yeah, nobody's just going to talk about the vampires that are currently sitting barbecuing on the roof. stood who stood and fell who fell not bad you've guided some of your charges to the light while others have fallen to the dark survival often comes at a great cost a cost that others 
sometimes must pay. Poor Nick. I look forward to our and next air. encounter. Perhaps I'll choose a story that's a little more homely next time. Somewhere you'd be guaranteed of a decent night's sleep. Rest assured, wherever it is, you'll find it extremely hard to leave. Until the next time. You know the way out. Was that pillar in the background? It looked like the Washington Monument. You're late, and you look like shit. I just got off the red eye. What's your excuse? Good flight? Oh, shit movie, shit meal, no leg room. You cram me in the back? By the toilets. Nice. Coffee wasn't so bad, though. Good fucking muffins. Did you read the brief? On the flight. How's it going with the analysis team? The ISG seemed to have heavy losses, but it wasn't a complete disaster. We just had to scrape some of them off the floor. Poor bastards. And the entities? Like nothing we've seen before. Cool check, Jason. First Lieutenant, Marine Force Recon. The best of the best, huh? Or so they advertise. Fuck! Now how many times do I have to keep telling you the same damn story? I understand. However, SETCOM needs to iron out any irregularities. Such as? The whole fucking thing was irregular! Such as why you allied with an enemy combatant? You weren't fucking there! Those things were ripping us to shreds! I don't give a damn who it was! We needed all the help we could get! I stepped back into that hell to save Celine. And that man was worth five of you people. Semper fucking five. And Sergeant K? Nicky didn't make it. So they cooperated with an Iraqi soldier down there? Republican Guard, if you can believe it. Must have made a hell of an impression for Kolchak to go back for him. I'm dying to meet this guy. I am not answering any more questions until I see my son. That's not how we do things around here. You don't have a clue. Jason came back for me. What does that tell you? Down there, this damn war of yours was over. I'd like to talk more about the entities. The vampires. I'm finding it very hard to believe that you killed those things with that. Untie me, and I'll show you how I did it. The analysis team are still pulling specimens from the site. There's carnage down there. They used dynamite? We don't know how they got their hands on it. Ah, oh, shame. This testimony could have been valuable. This is like Winterfold all over again. Uh-huh. Ah, and here we have Colonel Eric King, our in-house genius. He definitely got more than he bargained for. Those two were married, right? In the loosest sense of the word. He felt his death. Yeah, I've read the report. Wonder if there's more to it than that. The answer to that died with him. This comes down to Kalis. It mistook the temple for Saddam's weapon depot piece of shit system. I wouldn't say that. It's been a big find for us. We've been lucky. This is your definition of lucky? Well, do you believe me now? This is Miller. He'll be fully debriefing you. Debriefing? You need to get your damn priorities straight. Those things are still down there. What are you doing about them? There will be plenty of time to talk things through. Right now, I suggest you count your blessings that you came through the other side. It's nothing short of a miracle that you survived down there. I learned not to rely on anyone but myself. I was stronger than them all. I don't think shortly. that's right. 
We still on for next Sunday? Janet's making hot pie. You bet your ass we're on. I'll never get used to this job. Why would you want to? At least this one was localized. And the small blessings. So, what do you make of it all? Doesn't matter what I think. Only thing that matters is controlling the flow of information. As far as the world knows, not a damn thing happened here. That sounds about right. You want to know what it means to be a killer? Think of the most profound thing you've ever done. The most beautiful thing you've ever created. And I promise you, it's nothing compared to watching the life bleed out of someone. To see the fear in their eyes. To feel them pawing at you for release. To hear them pleading, begging. That's true art. That's what you have to be, an artist. I've left my mark on the world. Have you? And The Devil and Me, uh, I will be playing here next Sunday, um, hopefully with a friend. So that'll be fun. They definitely looks like they use the same kind of actors, um, like motion capture actors, because even The Devil and Me, some of the characters look the same, um, which is interesting. So thank you for joining me on my playthrough. Uh, I don't know how many episodes I'm going to split this up into. But if you enjoyed it, please stick with me and watch The Devil and Me coming up next. See you there.